Next to the stunning verdict in Orlando, the widow of the Pulse nightclub attacker found not guilty of helping carry out the worst terror attack in America since 9-11. The jury, siding with Noor Solomon's defense, describing her as a victim. Afterward, with her lawyers about to go free, Omar Mateen killed 49 people and injured 53 in the name of ISIS before he was killed by police. ABC's Victor Okendo is there in Orlando. Tonight, the wife of Orlando gunman Omar Mateen walking out of court a free woman found not guilty of helping her husband carry out a terrorist attack. We knew from day one she was innocent, and thank God it came out. Noor Salman sobbing as the verdict was read as victims sat silent. Prosecutors argue the 31-year-old mother knew what her husband was planning, going with him to scout targets and buy ammunition, showing the jury video of Mateen on the night of the massacre at Disney Springs, where prosecutors say he planned to hide an AR-15 in this stroller, but they said he was spooked by the police presence and went to Pulse instead. The defense says that last-minute decision meant there was no way his wife could have known. When we looked at all of the facts, it was clear that she didn't know. Prosecutors said Salman misled FBI agents during 11 hours of questioning before signing this statement, saying, I wish I could have done the right thing, but my fear and reality was holding me back. But her statements were not recorded in that interrogation without a lawyer. In the end, jurors were swayed by the defense, who argued Salman was easily intimidated, an abused wife, and simple-minded woman with a low IQ. Outside Pulse nightclub today, some of those who lost loved ones gathering to voice their disappointment with the verdict. One of the things that I wanted today was uh, some sense of closure. You didn't get that? No, I, I don't have that. Some here outside Pulse nightclub flat out angry with the outcome, but tell me now that the trial's over, it's time to move forward. Noor Salman is expected to return home to California where she will resume life with her son, who's now five years old. Tom? Victor Okendo for us tonight. Victor, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.